Sam, what's going on? We're not sure yet, but there's a rumor going around that one of the guys off the team was attacked last night. Attacked? What do you mean by attacked? We're not sure yet, but supposedly someone broke into his trailer and beat him up pretty bad. It's Charlie. You met him, right? Yeah, only once though. I can't believe someone did that. Do they have any idea who it was? No, I don't think so. Charlie never really had any enemies. I don't really understand why somebody would do this to him. I know, a very evil person, I bet. I think it's safe to say we're going to have to watch our back around here, especially the team. Who knows, it could have had something to do with the big game next week. You really think so? It's the only possible reason I can think of, yeah. Hey, Katie, you slept in pretty late this morning. I'm sure you've heard what happened, yeah? Yeah, I did sleep in late, didn't I? And for some reason I feel like I haven't slept at all. Yeah, I just found out. Why would someone do that to Charlie? It's up to the police to find out now. They told me that everyone who knew Charlie's gonna have to be questioned, just to see if they can get any information at all. You kids should help out too. Of course, me, Sam and CJ will go down to police station together. Great. I know Charles' family will appreciate y'all helping out like this. It can't be an easy time for them. The police won't need you down there for another couple of hours, so you have some time to kill before you have to head to the station. Hey, CJ, did you see a football come over here? Sam really has a strong arm. <laughs> And where were you last night, Katie? I got up to use the bathroom late last night and you weren't in your bed. I wasn't? That's strange. I don't remember getting up. Maybe I was getting something to drink. You weren't getting something to drink? The trailer ain't that big, Katie. You weren't here at all. But then you were back this morning. So where were you? I don't know, CJ. I was in bed. Maybe you were dreaming it. I didn't leave and I don't remember waking up last night, so you obviously dreamt it. Hmm, maybe. But I have my eye on you, Katie. What do you mean? Hey, what's taking so long? I know I've got a good throw, but it couldn't have went that far. Is everything okay here? Yeah, everything's fine, I think. We should probably head down to the police station. It'll be nice to help out any way we can, but I really don't know anything. I know, me neither. This attack just seems so random and out of the blue. I really hope Charlie is okay. Ben said he was in a pretty bad way. And besides, we could really do a Charlie for the big game next week. I'm sure he will be, Sam. Don't worry. He's in the hospital now. They'll look after him. Yeah, I hope so. Okay, well, let's get going. Hello there, we really appreciate you guys coming in to try and help us. Charlie's parents really want to find out what happened to their son, as do we. So any information you might have, we would really appreciate if you told us. Anything at all. What's your name, by the way? I don't seem to have you on my file. Oh, it's Katie. I'm new around here. Well, it's nice to meet you, Katie. And your second name, please. Um, uh, my second name, um, it's Perkins, Katie Perkins. Great, thank you. I'm Detective Forrester. Detective Mahoney was meant to be talking to you all now, but he's running a little late and I'm gonna stand in for him. Now, is there anything you remember from last night? Anything at all? 
I'm really sorry. I wish I could help, but I really didn't see or hear anything. That's okay, don't worry. But if you do think of anything, make sure you call us, okay? Of course. Okay, Katie Perkins, thanks for the help. You can send in the next person now. Okay, thank you, officer. CJ Matthews, it's been a while since you've been in here. Your past is behind you, I presume. No more troublemaking, right? Yeah, no more troublemaking for me. That's all behind me. Anyway, where's Detective Mahoney? He usually deals with everything to do with the trailer park. He's running a little late, so I said I'd start. Don't want to keep you all here too long. Anyway, did you happen to see or hear anything last night, CJ? Anything at all that could help us? No, nothing. I really have no idea what happened to Charlie. I did overhear, though, he said something about betting on the football game. Maybe that has something to do with it. You mean he bet on his own football game? Interesting. I think this might help a lot, CJ. Thanks. Anytime. Okay, well, you can send Sam in and stay out of trouble, CJ. See you later. Hello, Sam. I'm sure you know why we're talking to all of you here today. I'm just looking for any information about last night. Anything at all you can think of that may help us. We'd really appreciate it. I'm sorry, Detective. I don't know anything. Myself and Charlie had a small argument yesterday, and now I feel terrible. Really? An argument over what? Oh no, it was really nothing. It was just about Katie, the girl I'm dating. He didn't really like the idea of us together. He thought it was going to interfere with my football. Ah, okay. Well, don't worry, Sam. What happened to Charlie is not your fault. And I'm sure he knows that argument was just silly. Yeah, I, I hope so. So this Katie girl, she said she was new to the area. What's her story? Oh, that's a long one, detective. <laughs> Okay, well, perhaps we'll save that for another time, then. I've got work to do here. Yeah, sorry I couldn't be more help, Detective. I wish I knew more. Don't worry, Sam. Thanks for your help. You can go now. Sorry I'm late, Detective. I got held up at a crime scene. How did you get on? Did anybody see or hear anything? Nah, nobody heard anything. One thing was a little interesting, though. Our ex-troublemaking friend CJ said that Charlie had bet on his team's big game next week. Really? That is interesting, all right. Let's see if we can find out any more information about that. Where they got the money to bet on the game, maybe. Okay, Detective. I'm on it. Good. Thank you. I have to stop by the Magical Kingdom, but I'll see you later when I get back. No problem. See you later, Detective. <laughs> 